Hi there, Darren from Darren T Fitness. Thanks for tuning in, checking out my video tonight. Um, you know, over the years, I've tried many different ways to increase my metabolism, uh, to burn more calories and fat. You know, try to get back in shape and all that good stuff, and lose weight. Um, and I sampled a lot of the over-counter supplements, uh, different anything that you know, like fat burners and all that kind of stuff. They're supposed to increase your metabolism, and a lot of them have stimulants like caffeine in them. Um, you know, one thing I did kind of find out the hard way, you kind of had to watch out and, and, uh, kind of research which, what your what exactly is in what you're going to take because, um, I got a recommendation from somebody and they, I had a very bad reaction to the supplement and, uh, I lost a whole day and, uh, an evening pretty much. I lost 24 hours basically. Um, I had never felt that, felt that bad before in my life. Um. But just be careful if you take anything like that and talk to a doctor first before you go and and take some take something like that. Make sure it's you know gonna be okay for you to take and, and that kind of thing. But you probably really don't need it, but um if you're bound and determined to take it anyway, go see a doctor first and discuss it with them. Um would be the best thing to do, be safe. Um but the best thing you can do though is just go on a whole food diet, eating you know fruits and vegetables and grains and lean meats and fish and things like that so that you can you know give your body what you what it, what it needs and everything. Um there are about 21 I also want to make sure you get your um you eat the good fats too. And um like, you know, omega-3 fish oil um you know from like salmon, uh wild caught salmon. I wouldn't get anything farm raised um they end up putting chemicals and stuff like that in, especially salmon to make in the dyes and stuff like that to make it look pink like it nor like it normally should look. Um, the, a lot of the farm raised fish will have a lot of um, like a lot of mercury in, from what I from what I understand, and you don't want any of that stuff. Um, but there's about 21 different foods that you can try to just incorporate into your diet somehow. You don't have to eat them all at once. Um, but if you do, so I got a list here. I'm just kind of going to read read these to you here. I hope that's okay. Um, but I like just almonds because you know nuts are good for you. Um, almonds they've got good fats and protein things like that in them. Beans, uh, you know a lot of fiber and and, <laughs> and uh, uh, protein in those too. And then berries and um, even bone broth has got some different protein and stuff in it. Um, celery, um, it's you know of course it's going to be low calorie and everything for you, um, but it's so kind of a filled with a lot of water, I guess, um, from what I understand. And it's, you know, so that'll kind of help fill you up and you won't get as many calories. And of course, you don't want to have any of the fat calories either. Um, but it might keep you from, you know, keep you from eating as much or reaching for that piece of pie after after your, your dinner. Um, and then there's chia seeds, which are good, but you gotta soak, you should soak those overnight first. And then before you use them, um, you can do a lot of different things with chia seeds, um, but, you know, they got a lot of fiber and proteins and stuff like that in those, so they're they're really good for you. Um, and the next one, uh, of course, is one of my favorites is chocolate, uh, especially dark chocolate. Um, but you don't want to go and just get a Hershey candy bar and and eat that. You just want to you know it's a, some kind of dark chocolate. Um, I think they say seventy or eighty percent cacao. Um, it should have in it and um, to be be beneficial to get all the antioxidants and all that kind of good stuff for you that you need. And then um, apple cider vinegar, um, just mix that, just a cap full with a you know, glass of water, eight or ten ounce glass of water. Um, uh, cinnamon, that's supposed to be good for speeding up the metabolism and good for some other things too. Uh, coconut oil, um, and even coffee. Uh, then you can cook with curry. Um, uh, that is like, that's a spice, I believe. Um, you can just kind of cook with that. Um, use that for for speeding up everything. And then like I said, wild caught fish, uh, grapefruit, green tea, uh, hot, pe hot peppers and jalapenos, and uh, lean turkey, seaweed, everybody's favorite, I'm sure. Um, and uh, spinach, watermelon, and of course water. Um, it'll all help you kind of kick up your metabolism and, and help you, you know, speed that up and everything. So you're burning more calories and more fat. Um, but like I said, you know, don't eat them all at once. Just kind of incorporate them into your diet, um, and just make sure that all your calories that you do that you do get come from good sources. Um, like a bowl of fruit is going to be better than a piece of cake or a piece of pie, of course. Um, you know, so 
just kind of watch that kind of stuff. Um, you know, eat a high protein breakfast in the morning. That'll that can help kind of steady out your blood sugar, help you go, help you um, for a few, you know, help you just have a little bit of energy and stuff for you know a few hours after you after you eat and everything. So, but yeah, breakfast they say is more important meal of the day anyway. So you know, just make sure you got some good quality protein in there um, with your oatmeal or whatever in the morning, and uh, you should be good to go on that. Um, but that's kind of what I had today on the on metabolism. Um, from some of the foods and stuff so uh, if you got any tips or any questions um if you like this please uh share um you know um maybe it can help somebody hopefully um that's kind of what i'm trying to do is just kind of help people so anyway um uh, thanks again for watching i really do appreciate you taking the time out of your day to to um, watch my video and uh thanks and we'll see you on the next video